And there's a look at the king size right hander Lance Lynn. Against Houston he was very good giving up just three hits in five and two thirds innings gave up a couple of runs. Fan six too many walks but again we talk about the fact that he felt that he was kind of squeezed in that performance normally he has very good control. Two two swing and a miss he struck him out on a curveball. Struck him out twice but that's all right. Lance is happy it just took one more pitch to do it officially. So here's Wilmer Flores. 3-2 pitch. Wilmer takes high and inside. It's a walk. David VR went 0 for 3 with three strikeouts in the game yesterday. And this is hammered to left. And it's going to sail over the head of Benintendi. And on the move is Wilmer Flores. And he's going to have to drop anchor at third. Round one goes to David Villar or VR, and that thing is down and in at the knee. They set the location away, so really a mislocation, and VR makes him pay. And the point you make him is a good one. I mean, he hit it too hard. And here comes Michael Conforto. Not much else to pitch. Swing, and he hits one high and deep to right field. You can forget about this one. Way up into the bleachers. A three-run blast for Michael Conforto, and it's 3-0 Giants. That's a pretty hard hit ball. J.D. Davis with a, his first home run of the year yesterday hit it to the opposite field. And a swing and a miss strike three. Lance not happy as Conforto takes him deep. On the hill today for the Giants will be the left-hander Alex Wood making his first start of the year. Wood a six foot four inch 220 pound 10 year veteran. Now they swing and a foul tip into the glove of Blake Sable the catcher. Strike three, Anderson is gone. Luis Robert Jr. will bat four for eight, a homer, a double, and great defense in the series. Now there's a fastball on the inside corner, struck him out looking. Beauty. So two down. Abel is one for 12. He's got a major league hit, and it was a bunt. Uh, he's been pressing big time. It's not found a comfort zone. He drives one. The center field and deep. Out of here. And it's four nothing. I don't, I don't know why he would ever want a bunt for a hit. <laughs> Especially in a three-run count. This gives the Giants their all-time record for homering in six games. It would be Romy Gonzalez in the nine spot. There go the runners. That's strike three. They'll throw to second and safe. It's a double steal. Elvis got an enormous lead from second, so they took their shot at Zavala, and he got in there. They want to check it out. I think there's going to be an appeal on this one. They're going to take a look at it. Is the tag on, and it looks like it might be. After review, the call on the field stands. The runner is safe. San Francisco loses I thought loses that, that was going to be the case, and it was, and the inning will roll along. Well, now you got second and third with two outs. As Gonzalez did strike out. So here's Anderson. Smash to short past Estrada. Two runs home. Tim Anderson again snacks on left handed pitching and it's four to two. Well the best part of this one is that Estrada got a glove on it because if he doesn't get a glove on it it's going to get to Wade very quickly. If it gets to Wade that quickly you can't send Sebi. Here's Jock Peterson who popped out in the first. Oh wow. That's a swing and a miss and the ball ends up hitting him and so because of that let's see. He's out. Yeah he's out. So he swung through it. The ball hit him. That means the ball's dead. We are with a double and a run. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. Estrada grounded out his first time up. And swings here. Lines one over the head of the first baseman Vaughn and into right field a base hit. Gonzalez, who was over near the line, gets to it quickly. And that'll bring up Giants catcher Blake Sable. On the ground, and a base hit. And this is going to be a challenge. Here's the throw, and it's cut off, and almost out at first with Sable. Well, you got to give credit to Antoine Richardson, the Giants' first base coach. He was blowing a lung out at Sable to get back to the bag. He sniffed it out. 3-1. And Wade takes ball four. That one just missed. And with two down, here's Jock Peterson. Still the base is loaded, but now with two down. And a base hit into center field. One run's going to score. 
two run score. And Jock Peterson. Back to back hits to start this rally, but two outs now. The one two. In the air, right field, and that is in. A base hit for Andrew Vaughn. Conforto's up with the ball and has no play at the plate. Six to three, the Sox strike with two out in the fourth. That is a really big hit in a big situation for Andrew Vaughn. You don't want to come away from this inning empty. Here's J.D. Davis. Sharply up the middle and past the diving Anderson in a base hit. Here's Yastrzemski. He has in this game has popped out and he's bounced out. There's a high drive deep in the right field. It is out of here. And Mike Yastrzemski with his second of the year. And for the Giants. They're 11th in this series. And that's the add on we're talking about. Lamont has been on base twice in three plate appearances with a double and a walk. Look out. Look out. Is that the fourth time he's been hit this year? Gets him right in the tricep. That hurts. As Wilmer has walked, flied out deep to left, and popped up to second. One two pitch. There's a swing and a high drive to left field, and you can tell it goodbye. Over the right corner of the Chicago bullpen into the bleachers and Wilmer Flores has the Giants fourth home run of the game his first of the year and now it is 10 to 3 Giants. This is struck out grounded into a force singled and scored a run and lined out to short. He's got a base hit to right. They're going to wave in. VR or. And VR is going to score. So now here is Tyro Estrada. And he swings and lines one down the left field line. That's a fair ball. It will skip on toward the left field corner. Hits the sidewall and ricochets out to Benintendi in fairground. Coming in to score Conforto. Going to third, Yastrzemski. On a double by Tyro Estrada. It's 12-3 Giants in the night. J.D. Davis hits a grand slam to left. It's 16 to 3. The Giants now have the most home runs in a three game series in the history of this ballpark with 13. The last time the Giants had 13 home runs in a three game series was in that series where Willie Mays had the four home run game in Milwaukee 62 years ago. Beatty. And there's a swing and a fly ball in the right center on the move to his left. Bryce Johnson, he's got it. And the Giants win it and take the series from the White Sox two out of three and they finish up three and three on this road trip.